No, you're fine. It's okay. Uh, why don't you come in here? It's going to be a little close. Uh, hello one more time, Mulder Villains. Uh, I am here at D23 Expo in Anaheim, California, and why don't you go ahead and introduce yourselves real quick. Uh, I am Liz. I am the SVP of Creative at Loungefly. I'm Derek. I'm the co-SVP of Creative <laughs> at Loungefly. And I, I was just told, waiting, you two are real life partners. We are. We are. That is amazing. <laughs> so we design together, we create together, we live We together. do everything together. Is it one of those cases where somebody's sitting quietly and then a backpack flies across the room and it's like, you have new news? <laughs> Actually, the crazy part is we don't ever really argue about work, like ever. ever. Really? Yeah. We actually bring so many different things to the table. Of course, relationship things are always, they're, they're, they're big, but like at work, it's never been an issue. He does leave laundry on the floor, so <laughs> can't get away from that. Okay, I was about to say, we argue over this thing called the toilet seat, I still haven't mastered. But um, what is it like when you're trying to direct artists? That, that must be, I don't want to say challenging, but it has okay, to come with its own complexity. I think for me, um, I started my career as a graphic artist. Really? Yes. So I was a graphic artist doing um, girls apparel. Okay. Uh, when I graduated from art school, That's I got my degree in illustration. So I, um, being an artist, it's uh, very easy for me. My whole career has been an artist or directing artist. They're an amazing group of people, and it's my job and other creative leaders' job to get the best out of them. Um, so I have great directors, art directors, that work with our artists, and you work with every artist differently. They all have a different skill set, and I think Lounge Play is a testament to um, our ability to get the best out of every one of them. Uh, how many people does it take to create a Lounge Play? Because I can't just be as simple as, look, drawing! There's a lot. So. There's the concept phase, right. you know, we'll have an idea. And then from there, you go to design. So we have designers saying, okay, what silhouette is that going to go on? Do we need a new one or not? Then from there, that silhouette goes to the actual artist. From there, the artist is creating and all that kind of stuff. Then we review it, and they're like, you know what, this is good. Send it to our licensing uh, approval team. Then they're submitting it to a Disney, and then Disney's reviewing it. Maybe there's some changes. Comes back to our licensing team, goes back to that artist. And maybe to a retailer. If it's for a retailer, then the buyer looks at it. And it goes through a PD and they spec it, get it ready to send to the factory. Then we start going through sample approvals. It's a whole process. It's about a year long process. There's at least at any one point, I don't know how many people. about five to ten people in the room dealing with the one. Yeah. Yeah. Man, I'm, I'm trying to imagine the chain of events, and I'm sure I'm out of my depth already. <laughs> but uh, as I'm talking to you, I do notice some symmetry and pattern here. Yes. The, the ghosts are catching my attention. Yes. This is our uh, up-and-coming pastel ghost collection. Okay. Sneak peeking. Yes. So, so it's, um, we have a unisex fit tee. We have a reversible crossbody. Oh. We have ears and two mini backpacks coming in the collection. Okay. Well, I know what my kids are asking for now. That's great. <laughs> Loungefly.com and, and our social medias will be announcing when it's going to happen, so it's going to yes. be soon. We don't okay. have an exact launch date yet. But we have, we always have our traditional, you know, black, your orange, your white, Halloween. We're like, we want a pastel Halloween. We want something more like, fun, a little, a little bit lighter. different. I like the concept. It's very fitting with the Disney brand. Yeah. It's very good. <laughs> All right, well, thank you very much. This has been terrific. Awesome. Thanks for coming in. Enjoy the rest of the convention. You also. Thank, thank you. you so much.